you're late. No, I'm not, Mr. Thompson. Don't argue with me, son. If I say you're late, you're late. No, he's not. Leave him alone. Get back in the kennel, you. You take your hands off him. Oh, it's like that, is it? We mustn't touch you. Let me go, Mr. Thompson. <laughs> ah, gone. You bastard. You what? You're getting a bit big for your boots, aren't you, Fitton? You've no right to do that. Right? You're a fine one to talk about rights, aren't you? You want to worry about that little wife of yours. What about her rights, then, eh? Hey! <laughs> If you love me, say... Here's one I fancy. You reckon it, do you? So do I. Sports fuel. If you love me... Here, how about both champ? Say... And that one there. What did you mean by that? Oh. Oh, well, um... By all accounts, she isn't too happy, is she? I'll tell you what. If you don't feel up to it, you leave it to me, I'll do it for you. All right? Ow! What's come over you? You dirty swine. All right. Come on, then. Come on. If you want it, I'll give it to you. to do a job for me, with my wife. He said what? You're finished, Fitton. Go on, get your cards. Stick them. You said what? <laughs> How could you? You do a job for him? You? You couldn't do a job for our cat! Yeah. You hear me? Yeah. Why, the milkman's been doing your bloody job for years! Get. 